my blog post about creativity, analysis, and innovation on ANSYS Space Claims blog has resulted in a number of people asking for a practical example illustrating the process. However, the process of inventing new commercial products is usually top secret and rarely available for public display. Therefore, I decided to invent something myself and document how I did it. I came up with the idea to create a minimalistic, hand-powered pill dispenser that can be cleaned in a dishwasher. It should be both easy to use and reliable. It should also have a built-in sorting mechanism that dispenses one pill at a time from a disorganized pile of pills. Plus, it's important that the pills don't break or wear in the process. Note that I work at a software company, and I have zero prior experience working on this type of problem. I did a preliminary internet search and, f and did not find a technical description of a similar device. Therefore, it's fair to say that I'm starting from a blank slate. I gave myself 16 working hours to invent an appealing conceptual solution. This is what I did. I knew very little about what this engineering problem would entail, so I started with the most basic fragments of a solution that I could come up with. A container of shuffled pills. Then I decided to, to try a linear motion concept. This makes it easy to seal the container and lends itself to a push-button user interface. Analysis of these early models showed that it was difficult to create a push-button mechanism that would reliably dispense one single pill at a time. Solving this complex problem would require both creative thinking and the analytical capabilities of dynamics for space claim. The subsequent design iteration became a significant leap forward. The first simulations had given me a much better understanding of the, of the difficulties, and it had become clear that I had to use a series of concise steps to reliably extract a single pill at a time. I also had to accept that I might not be able to design a failsafe solution without using electronic components. I needed to come up with a recovery system and a way to prevent the pills from de being damaged when stuck in the wrong position. The solution was a spring mechanism between the push button and the slider, which puts a definite limit on how hard the sliders, slider is able to push against the pills. I then realized that I could devise a funnel so that the pills would fall into a column of uh, a single layer of pills. This serves as an effective step in filtering out individual pills, and it also minimizes their exposure to abrasive rubbing against the slider. This was a breakthrough, but had the negative consequence that the pills were on the verge of getting stuck in the main compartment. They interlocked over the gap and were prone to form a vault-like structure that blocked the flow. Now I had to find a way to stop the pills from clogging the funnel. I watched the mechanical uh, behavior from every angle exper and experimented with the geometry. It became apparent that I had to break the vault. I decided to disrupt the symmetry to ensure that the gravitational pull exceeded the strengthening effect of the horizontal force. The solution turned out to be trivial. I simply allowed the pills to slide down a moderate slope and ensured that the opposing wall was vertical. In fact, all planes are now vertical except the gentle slope. This guarantees that the vertical pull is the dominating factor at the slot, which prevents the pills from obstructing the flow. There, now I have spent 16 hours inventing this device. I'm pleasantly surprised that I was able to get this far in such a short period of time. It's not a finalized product, but it's a strong conceptual solution. In the process, I've gone from nothing to a vastly improved awareness and understanding of the challenges and potential solutions. I've also gathered extensive data that I can use to illustrate my findings and present my solution to colleagues, management, suppliers, and clients.
I hope that you've enjoyed this video and that I've been able to give you at least a glimpse into how Dynamics for Space Claim facilitates innovation. The data obtained when using Dynamics for Space Claim guides the innovation process forward. This makes Dynamics for Space Claim a fun, rewarding, and invaluable innovation tool. Thank you for watching.